Hey, Yammerinos. Yammers. Yammers. Yammerlamma ding dong. Welcome. Wow, 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 wow. Welcome. Back to Blood Blood. Blood Blood. Whoa. Wait, do you get a load of this blood? It's born. It's born. Hi, everyone. We're happy to be back for Bloodborne. Yeah, it's been a while. Since I we, had to we remember was what out. I was doing. Yeah. Yeah, we had to discuss what you were doing. Yeah. Yeah, Resident Evil 4 is where we were at. Yeah, we were in Resident Evil 4 town. Mm -hmm. We were in, as I titled the stream, the snake zone, parentheses, bad. Yeah. Because that's where you're headed. You've experienced one snake man. Yeah. And I bet when you experienced him, you were thinking, that's probably the only one of those. I only fought one blue alien. Yeah. And so. there probably won't be any more of those either, right? No. Nah. That's probably what you're thinking. Mm -hmm. And you're Definitely. like, I killed the snake man. Mm -hmm. He was one of a kind. Mm -hmm. Nothing like him out there. Mm -hmm. And um, as the title of the stream might have clued you in, there's more. There's more snakes. Are there snake women, though? Mmm, snimmin. <laughs> I hate that. I hate that. Nimmin, 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 nimmin. First time seeing Julia's new hair. It looks good. Thank you. I agree. Thank you. We, um, we spent a lot of family time today. We did. The fam came over to celebrate Julia's birthday late. Yeah. And the, the, the niece and nephew were freaking on one. <laughs> they were amped to be here. They were amped to be here. Oh, you know what? I want to show off what Clara colored for me. Don't spoil anything. Oh, yeah, I won't. The reveal is good. I will say, though, that Clara came in. My computer was on. She came into my office, hit every single button on my roadcaster, which is my, my audio input device she had every single button and adjusted every single lever on the roadcaster so i'm i'm hoping i got all the settings back to where they're supposed to be <laughs> but time will tell okay so my niece done colored me uh she looked at her disney coloring book and she was like I want to find the perfect one for julia for her birthday as a birthday gift and then i'm going to color it in and uh, so she kept going through, and she was like, really? According to my brother, like, really taking every page in? And I was like, this one. <laughs> <laughs> what could represent Julia better <laughs> than Maleficent? <laughs> this one is Julia's vibe. <laughs> for sure. And she walked in, and she was holding it. And she was like, happy birthday. <laughs> and like waited for me to, to judge. She was so excited to give this to Julia that um, I went on Friday to a concert with Julia's brother, Mike. Mm -hmm. And I went to go pick him up. And I went in the house. And um, Clara immediately ran up with the coloring book. And then she was like, Jacob, I colored a picture for Julia for her birthday. I'm like, oh, okay, do you want me to take it to her? And she goes, no, I'm going to hold on to it for now. And then I'm going to bring it over on Sunday after soccer practice. Yeah. And I was like, I feel like you have too strong a conception of um, yeah. dates and times and your own schedule for not even being three years old. Mm -hmm. But that's fine. You bring it over on Sunday after soccer practice. <laughs> I, we didn't talk about it, but today she was talking about the kitchen table. Which is a, uh, we got it from my brother. And she, um, she was commenting on it. And Jacob said he had a, a misspeak because we have been several hours in on two toddlers. Yeah. And, uh, she, she, she was commenting about it. And Jacob said, Oh, thanks. Your brother gave it to me. I was thinking of Julia's brother yeah but it's clara's dad yeah and i just like got the wires crossed but clara goes no 
He's a baby. He's a baby. He's too young He's to too give you young. a table. He can't give you a table. <laughs> I just like, no. She also remembered a bit from the last time she hung out with us where Jacob. Oh, my God. It's so funny. Played with a worm that she had called Mr. Snail. Yeah, she has. A, there's a wor cat worm toy that she called Mr. Snail. And then she also had the, this little gingerbread woman toy mm -hmm. That's and so like i cat toy. i started doing this bit where i was being mr snail and i kept saying that the gingerbread woman was my wife mm -hmm. and mr. i'd be Snail's like wife, yeah. i'd be like what are you doing with my wife and then clara at first was like really confused by this bit but yeah. then she like totally bought into it and she would be like mr snail i've got your wife and then we just <laughs> run off screaming and i have to chase her going like Bring back my wife right now. She's my rock. <laughs> then you would just I need hear this her. toddler running like this. I can't do anything without my wife. Please give her back. But and then she's go, no, I'm not doing it. I got your wife. But today she like walked up to Jacob and was like, where's Mr. Snail? Where's his wife? Yeah, it's so been like, like months. It's been months since we played this game. And she came right up to me and was like, where's Mr. Snail? And where's Mr. Snail's wife? Because so, we got to play the game. So we found Mr. Snail and we found his wife. And she was in this room and came out into the living room holding the wife and just goes, I have your wife. <laughs> and then ran away. <laughs> she said it so theatrically. Yeah, she did. I have your wife. It was really good. Yeah, it was, uh, it was a good time, but it was also exhausting. The other really funny moment was like, okay, so she had soccer practice and then she immediately came over and then ran around and screamed for several hours. So she got a little overwhelmed and like was very tired, but refused to go to sleep like toddlers do. And so she had like kind of an emotional, you know, when they get like, it's like a little too much, so they just start to cry because they don't know how to like handle this emotion. So <laughs> she started, she like, I feel bad for laughing, but like, I love how she deals with things. She got really emotional and she like felt it coming and she like walked over to the window and Jacob and I have like a, like a love seat that's by one of the windows in the living room. And she went over to the love seat and then she like, and the, it's like a corner window, right? And she goes over to the corner window and grabs the windowsill with two hands and just goes. <laughs> <laughs> it was the most dramatic pose. She was like standing on the chair like this, leaned over with both hands with her head down, just like. <sighs> <laughs> then she would just <sighs> wipe her eye. And she'd be like. <sighs> <laughs> and she, she was like, oh, I'm okay. <laughs> Yeah, she came right back. It was so she funny. She had to get it out. Oh. Uh, but yeah, it was a good time. It was, yeah, she was a delight. And then my parents were there too, who were always a time. They were fun. We didn't show her the puppet. We, we forgot about the puppet. There was a lot going on. There was a lot going on. It was wild style over here. For some reason, Clara was also terrified of my grandmother. <laughs> I don't know why. We were trying to get her to talk to my French grandma and she wouldn't. On like a, like a Zoom call. Yeah. But. And she kept picking up every object in our house, like zeroing in on the most expensive and fragile things. And, and then picking she kept them taking up. her hair clips and then going up to the TV with it. <laughs> my brother would have to catch her every time. Yeah. And then Frankie was there and Frankie is doing a thing right now where he puts a beverage in his mouth and then he just spits it out. <laughs> So he kept spitting it out on the table and then just going, yay! <laughs> Disasters, all of them. And then Clara, every time she would see Joy, would just start sprinting at Joy. We had to be like, stop chasing the cat. She, she doesn't, doesn't like, like it. it. <laughs> and then Joy kept coming out being like, that was kind of fun. Let's do it again. It's not fun. It's not fun. Yeah. What a, what a disaster. But now we're playing Bloodborne. Yeah. With y'all. Yeah. I'll see and if I'm, I'm excited. I'm excited to get back in. Me too, man. Get stuck in. Get stuck in. El get gato. tucked in. <sighs> Tuck me in. Every time it's like, I know we do this like every Sunday, except for last Sunday because Mocha was there. Um, 
I forget how to play like every week. I super. Okay, I think. <laughs> Does one roll? Yeah, I remember how to play. I think, yeah, yeah, yeah. And Lim's got his <laughs> new fashions on. I love this outfit. It's the, the collar is so hilarious. It's it's comically large. It's like a mascot head costume. With his tiny little face. Yes. So I think we're headed to this third one here. No, not the third one. The second one. Frontier Headstone Forbidden Woods. These woods are forbidden. Away we go. For a reason. In case you didn't see it when we were talking about it on Wednesday, thank you to everyone who came to Mocha last weekend. Mocha. We'll talk about it more on tomorrow's Drawfee episode. Yes, we will. Where am I going? You're Did going I explore in, everything yeah, this way? Yeah, take a right and you're going in that right. gate you opened. I got the, the shortcut, yes. And I think there's a dude to talk to in here, too. This guy? Hello? Hello? Well, certainly not him. Hello? Um, I know there's like an NPC around here somewhere. <laughs> Good day, sir. Oh. Found him. There he is. Good day, sir. Good day to you, sir. He kind of looks like a French legionnaire. Is he wearing like a hat that goes all the way down? Where's his face? I mean, he's wearing like... It's just sort of like a... <laughs> Like the top of a top hat that he put on and it went all the way down. Oh, he's got a hole. A hole for looking. Hi. You want to sit with me, buddy? Joy, did you just put this here? Okay, no. Hello. Ah, a new face, are you? And an accomplished hunter. It would appear. I am obsessed with this dude's <laughs> entire look. This is my favorite character so far. Master of the league. Just by outfit. He's the master of the league. Cleanse the streets of all the filth that spread about during the hunt. Okay. Like any half decent hunter ought to. You know? Haven't you seen enough of these wretched beasts? Freakish slugs and mad doctors. Sentence these fiends to death. Freakish slugs and mad doctors. What do you say? Why not join the league? Um. You want to join the League of Extraordinary Gentlemen? I mean, if you put it that way, yeah, I do. The League of of this guy. Yeah. Yes, as a hunter, well should commit this to heart. Okay. Our own Carol Rune, symbol of the league. Our own Carol Rune. Symbol of the... Oh, you just meant this, like, ladybug looking. He looks like the collar of his shirt. Brims oh, yeah. Vile scum and is permeated by their rotten stench. Hi, right, Batman. Just <laughs> think. Now you're all set to hunt and kill to your heart's content. Hunt? In cooperation with your fellows, your League Confederates. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't say anything funny. No. There is one thing you must know. Okay. By the oath of the League, those who bear its rune will see vermin. Vermin writhe deep within all filth and are the root of man's... Is that the new ride? We ride deep? Vermin we writhe deep? To be vermin writhe deep? The League exists to expunge all vermin. If I make a Bloodborne shirt, it's going to say vermin ride deep. Vermin writhe, writhe, writhe deep. deep. Until we are rid of all parentheses within all filth. Continue to hunt and kill. This bloody fate is ours alone. Okay. Do not expect the world to grasp our work. Mm -hmm. But remember, the Confederates will always have my. Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay. All right. We're not I, siding with the Confederates no, 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 now. No, no, I feel no, like listen, you didn't listen. mention that ahead of time. You should have said that up top. You know that was my bad for not reading yeah, the fine print. You really save that for the end of the the, the the thing, huh? Can I give you back this rune? Um. Hmm. Hmm. 
It's okay. It wasn't capital C. It wasn't capital C. Well, it was a lowercase C. It lower was lowercase C. C. The league exists to expunge all vermin. Ruins <laughs> of any piece of human culture. The staring Luigi face cracks me up. Until we are rid of all vermin, you must continue to hunt and kill. Okay. This bloody fate is ours. Well, I have a problem. Every time I go to sleep... And I come back, all the baddies are back again. But remember, the Confederates will all... Oh, lantern. stop saying that. Stop saying that. Each other. Look at his little lantern. Always. What's with the accordion shell on top? What is that? <laughs> what you, what's, what's doing there? Oh, he's got a little train whistle. Doot, doot. I'm such a fan of this outfit. I mean, come on. I mean, he is dressed like a Civil War soldier, kind no, of. No, <laughs> I was thinking French Legionnaire. Come on. I mean, maybe that too. Maybe that too. Don't ruin this for me. Maybe he's dressed like a like a like a good Civil War soldier. No. <laughs> <laughs> Time to go down, baby. Take me down to the Paradise City. Where there's hopefully not a lot of snakes. Don't fall. There's nothing down there. There's nothing for you down there, Hunter. <laughs> Oh, come. <laughs> come on. That's too many. They put snakes in him. <laughs> I like that we always say it in Mickey's voice, but it's Sora saying it to Mickey. They put snakes in him. What? It's just more fun to say it in Mickey's voice. Mickey, it's Riku. They put snakes in him. What? Oh, look at this cold lantern. I love so much the ha ha ha. The ha 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 is really good. It's ha 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 is my favorite of combination of the newest droppy emotes. Because it seems like simultaneously like you're laughing, but also you're being really sarcastic about it. Now, snakes on the ground. Snakes are you just a on ball the ground. Of snakes? Looking like a fool with your snakes on the ground. Are you a snake king? Snake king. Snaking. Snaking. <laughs> Do snake jump scare. I don't even know where that guy came from. What the hell? Did you fall oh, from the he must sky? Have, he must have come down from the ledge. That was spooky. hit faster jerk okay i just imagine like miyazaki designing this area and he's like i want to do something with snakes but snakes don't scare me anymore <laughs> like i need some way to make snakes scary again and then he woke up like in a sweat at 4 a.m 20 snakes and he's like more snakes snake ball that's the answer Like a rat king, but with snakes, yeah. But that's what I was... I know, snake king. Snake king. Oh, I thought you were dead. No, Sorry. I'm alive. I'm right here. Mm. I'm talking to you. Mm. Wouldn't it be a crazy twist if I'd been dead the whole time? <laughs> I was trying to do a bit over here. I'm really sorry. Bless you. I'm not... Olive, I don't have a lap for you right now, bud. Still gonna try. I hear someone moaning. Oh, Joy slapped her. Oh, I can't pause. Oh, okay. It's okay, Joy. You defended your, your claim. Joy's been getting lappy again. Oh, come on. You punk. Oh, and we tricked Olive with the blanket. Who 
breathing. Blanket replacement maneuver. This is me in the morning. Um. What you got up there? You know, I'll walk away. Joy, you're like holding me around the waist right now. <laughs> she is. <laughs> She's got her paws like around my waist. Do you think that feels good? I, like, yeah. It's got to be a relief, right? Like, if I had that many snakes in my head, I think, like, getting the snakes out of my head would probably feel pretty amazing. I couldn't... You know how I've used the monocular, like, 20 times today? I don't know what's wrong with my brain. I used the monocular, like, 20 times today, and then when I went to heal, I was like, it's square. It's the monocular button, right? But that's the monocular button. <sighs> Hey, is that jerk from the other door? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> so dramatic. You won't get any snake juice betwixt these lips. <laughs> no! What the fuck is wrong with you? Why would you do that? No. I took one little slight steppy and then it just like beep. You, I don't want to victim blame you. No, roll back the tape. But what I do want to say is you should not have been near that ledge. But it was a funny you bit. You should not have been near that ledge in a Souls game. You know how the ledges are. They're, they're slippery. What was it, covered in moss? I do like how long it took for it to say you died. Like the, the, the game, the game, the game yeah. acknowledged that it was stupid. It like couldn't believe you had done it. It was like just I... looking at the water, like surely. Didn't. It was like double checking the code. It's like something must have gone wrong. That can't have happened, right? Yes, I agree. I agree. I didn't. I didn't. I agree. I didn't do it. This is a complete non sequitur. Okay. Get him before he snakes. He snaked. Is that, isn't that that Carrie Underwood song? <laughs> before he snakes. I'm gonna slash that dude's tires. I took my saw cleaver to both headlights. Stuck a blood vial right in my thigh. <laughs> All right, where's my junk? Over here? Be so careful here. The rocks are slippery. They do look wet. So maybe it was just slippery. You don't, know, don't go back over here. It's like crazy? what they say about the Grand Canyon. Stand behind the fence. Don't go in front of the fence. Stay behind the fence. Because this will happen to you. This will happen to you. I'm also impressed by your ad-libbing of the Carrie Underwood song. Thank you. I and appreciate that. And making it bloodborne-y. It was good. Anyway, I just wanted to ask if anyone had listened to that new Willow Smith song. Because it's like my favorite song of the year so far. And also, I'm still in disbelief that Willow Smith released a song that was in 7-4 time signature. 7-4 time signature that then switches to 4-4 four, four in the chorus. And uses like exclusively jazz chords. Yeah, you gotta check it out. It's incredible. It's called a uh, symptom of life. It's awesome. Another snakes over there. 
No, oh, God. I heard that song and then the other song that she put out before that one. And now I'm like seriously wondering if she's about to like put out my favorite album of the year. <laughs> favorite math rock artist Willow Smith. Yeah. Like a little bit. A little bit. It's a mathy song. Yeah, Willow Smith is in Will Smith's daughter as in Whip My Hair, yeah. She's come a long ass way since Whip My Hair. She does actually have a lot of songs I like. I whip my hair from back and forth. Close. <laughs> I don't know how to get up there. Where that dude experiencing asthma is. You have an inhaler? Use your inhaler. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna guess the entrance is like a cave thing over here because he's like facing that way. I'm gonna keep going. I made a joke about her being Will Smith's daughter I didn't actually know. Yeah, she's literally Will Smith's daughter. That looks like that sucks. You gonna go, you gotta go get that spitty gem. Yeah. He's spitting. Oh, when the snakes get big. I'm scared of the spitters. He's just a big boy. Yeah, that's why I don't like him. And there's like limited movement range and there's like a lot of little guys okay. yeah that's a bad scene over here not gonna lie to you thank you for not lying to me twin yeah, bloodstone shards oh come on no oh look who's down here the fuck? Are you excited to see him? I mean, yeah, kinda. I did just mention him. Oh my god, there's so <laughs> many! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> bloop, 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 bloop. Oh, he's coming! Don't. You seem like you're gonna suck my face, and I don't want that. Suck my kiss. <laughs> suck my kiss. All right, well. Watch what? Out. There's a koosh ball There's over a koosh there. ball. He's special in ways you don't understand. Yes. Come to me. My angel of music. Come to me, sweet sacred bliss. That mouth ow, was ow, made ow, to ow, suck ow. my kiss. Okay. What you got for me? A little arcane drug, blood, drug, drug, blood, drug, drug, All right. What's arcane blood, drug, drug? All right, I'm gonna take on the Koosh Ball. You got it. You can do it. I'm scared. I don't know why I'm so scared today. There's two of them. Oh my God. Watch out, he's got lasers. He blasted. He started blasting. He's got the magic from Dark Souls, Holy be careful. Holy shit. <laughs> Cut it out. 
Good lord. Anti-clockwise metamorphosis. So I don't turn into a snakehead? Yay, anti-clockwise metamorphosis. Is that what that means? Uh, the ads are going to start soon if you want to chill for a sec. Before continuing. <laughs> I want everyone to see this casual pose that... Oh. You getting up, Joy Cat? What's up? You going to go fight Olive? Or do you want to sit on the blanket? Uh -huh. You want the blanket spot, do ye? Do ye? She's just sitting here, staring at Olive clean her butt. Bow, 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 bow. Ding, dingy, ding, dingy, ding, dingy, ding, dingy. Someone in chat earlier asked if that was actually a real song. It is. It's a Red Hot Chili Peppers song. It's called Suck My Kiss. It's really, that's a really gross thing to say. Yep. It is. I don't know why he said that. <laughs> I don't know why he thought that was okay to say. Uh, the ads have begun. Yes. We got three thrinnets. Thrinnets of ads. Thrinnets. Then during that time, we will discuss Suck My Kiss. During co-op? Mm. 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 No, thank you. I was just checking out what the um, impurity rune did. And anti-clockwise metamorphosis. Yeah, it raises stamina. Your stom. My stom. Let's look up the lyrics to Suck My Kiss. Okay. I think someone just said that they don't understand why Twitch thinks they have a sub, but they super don't want to hear about the song Suck My Kiss. <laughs> <laughs> it's very funny. But what if I said, someone full of fun, do me till I'm well done. Lil Bo Peep coming from my stun gun. <laughs> uh, you just ate so much garlic bread. What if I said, chicka chicka D, do me like a banshee? <laughs> Poets of the Red Hot Chili Peppers are not. <laughs> it's kind of poetry. Mm. If you think about it. <laughs> Surely not. What if I said, lowbrow is how, swimming in the sound of bow wow wow. <laughs> do you think he just like gave up halfway through that sentence and he's like, I'm just going to put in some sounds that rhyme with the sounds I made before. I don't think he gave up because that implies that he ever gave a shit to begin with. But the thing is, the song's a jam. <laughs> I actually don't know the song. You know the song. I don't know the song. You, you know the song. Every Red Hot Chili Pepper song sounds the same to no, me. No, it's different than the others. This one's about sucking his kiss. All I know is Dream of Californication and then the other one that was really popular. This one is one of them that was really popular. Wow. You know, when Anthony Kiedis wrote, beware, take care, most motherfuckers have a cold ass stare, he was talking about Julia. Mm hmm I do. Julia's most motherfuckers. Yeah, I am. I am the representative for motherfuckers. With the cold ass stare. Yeah, I walk up to Red Hot Chili Peppers and say, hi, I'm the representative of uh, motherfuckers. <laughs> and here is my stare. Here is my cold ass stare. Yeah, that's me. I got them baby blues. Do you know what a nightmare my life was like when the White Walkers became a thing in Game of Thrones? Because of your blue eyes and pale skin? Yeah. And your cold ass stare? Yeah. Yeah. That's gotta be, that's gotta be a problem for you. We going back to game? We going back to game. Back to the, the snone? Everyone is saying, oh no, Kaz, but I didn't see what happened to Kaz. What happened to Kaz? Nothing can happen to Kaz. Ooh. 
Where the hell? I gotta subtitle all this later and relive it. Oh, I see. That would do it. I understand. I thought something actually bad happened to Kaz. I'm glad it's just the normal bad the stuff normal that happens bad. to Kaz. The usual bad. The bad that we do. This is the do. usual bad stuff that happens to Kaz. The bad that we do onto Kaz. Yeah, nothing out of the ordinary. Other than when I point out a big booty uh, comment on one of our videos, that's like, the commentary in this is great. And I send it to Kaz because they make me laugh every single time I see them. Yeah, we get those bot comments where the image, their little icon is just like a ass. Yep. And then it's like, wow, what a thoughtful presentation. <laughs> yeah. It's like, damn, these bots have no idea what this content is. It's the pig. He's the pig. The pig is here. <laughs> Why is he so fucking loud? <laughs> Where you going, bro? He's got a jaunty little walk. Yeah, he does. Don't ruin that pig's day. Big hog. Big hog. Someone in the comments reminded me of Big Hog just now. That was a fun game. Why was that sound effect so loud? The sound effects are based on like where your camera is. Yeah. They're not based on what Lim hears, they're based on what we hear as like the little fucking Locky 2 holding the camera following <laughs> him around. Who's laughing? You laughing? You don't have vocal cords. No, he's screaming. What? 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 <laughs> he's a snake somewhere. What? You trapped yourself. <laughs> trapped yourself in your own snakes. You wrecked yourself. <laughs> he was Gregnant. It's so beautiful. The miracle of life. What are you gonna do, throw a Molotov at him? Yeah. Do it. Oh, toasty. So toasty. Run out. Okay. Oh, wee. That did a lot of damage. Yeah, it did. Not like a huge fan of that. Gave you three blood vials, though. So technically, he did negative damage to you, if you think of it that way. My guy. Cut it out. There's too many snakes on the screen. You're ruining the the frame rate. This game already struggles enough with its frame rate. Somehow, even still on the PS5. Wow. Where's this damn pig? I hear it. Yeah, at least we have the fast load times. That's true. Piggy. Are there two piggies? <laughs> there are two piggies inside of you. What? Yo, that sucks. I never fought a single piggy. I know you're so, that's the problem. That's why you're so scared of them. I am scared of them. You don't know your own power. Listen, dudes, I don't eat pork anymore. Shouldn't that be enough? This pig is at the grave. This pig is mourning. Hit him with the sneak up. Rectal exam. Hit him with the examination. 
What's in there? <laughs> Show me what's in there. Pig vanquished. Yeah. You say don't say that, but that's there's no other way to refer to what happens there. Yeah. I mean, it's literally... It's pretty it's straight up and down. I done shoved my hand in there. You put your hand in there. <laughs> the disrespects for his mourning. <laughs> Whose grave is it? Oh, you got the graveyard set. Grave God graveyard. So hard because I'm not. <laughs> Wish that was me. <laughs> <laughs> In Iceland, when the weather is good, we say, it is beautiful weather in a non-sexual way. <laughs> I found an Icelandic comedian on Instagram today, and that quote's been living in my head. Mostly then because his son follows it up with saying words in English, and then dad says, can you say I love you, daddy? And he says, no! This is a cute video. Watch out for the snakes, by the way. Oh god, these. I didn't fight these yet. Once you get in there, he'll stop spitting, but he will do other things. Jesus Christ. That you don't like. No, come on. Punk ass. Why is this graveyard full of giant... Might, Wretched beings. Might be a good time to pop an antidote. To be honest. Save yourself the blood vials. Yeah, that's true. See, at first I was like... Oh, the healing church has closed off the path to Bergenworth because they don't want anyone finding the forbidden knowledge. Now I'm like, oh, they closed the path to Bergenworth because it's literally chock-a-block full of snakes, top to bottom. Yeah. Julia, stay away from those edges. And this is what happens <laughs> when you have one-sided media, folks. You know? You know? Some people just see a situation and they make it up. They make up the, the causes. They make up the facts. And no one's checking it. Well, They're reading the headlines. The bigger, Everyone's like they're closing it off because they're gatekeeping their knowledge. The bigger problem, I think, is that um, they, didn't, they didn't say that it was full of snakes. If they just said it's full of snakes, I think... But should they have to say everything, you know what I mean? Yeah. They shouldn't have to say everything. So true. I don't know why I'm saying that sarcastically. Maybe in this case, yes, I do believe that. That they should have told everyone what the dealio was. I guess because they're the church, you know? So I think... Pigways is is a shortcut. This way? Yeah. As I recall, pigways is a shortcut. Because I think the other way is you're going to be encountering a boss. Olay, motherfucker. Ah! <laughs> okay, well, never mind. <laughs> Guess we'll just die instead. <sighs> that's, I pulled the That's you. another way to handle it, I, I guess. I pulled the you. Just to die. <laughs> In instantly. Instantaneously. Well, at least now you can do sort of a faster run back, I guess. I feel like you've gotten all the goodies. Yeah. You got all the goodies and you killed all the baddies. Do those big guys come back? The pigs? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well. They come back big time. The spitty snakes? Oh, yeah. Hmm. Everyone comes back. Everyone is here. For Julia, the bosses are the shortcuts. <laughs> <laughs> so true. That dude's head even came back. 
That sucks, man. Did I fall down here? But here that I fell down? Yeah. I, mean, I think if you just like basically follow the path, you'll get there. the sound their heads make all of their noises are really good i wish my head made that sound i am glad it doesn't as the person who lives with you i feel like i'd be at peace can you imagine if you had a headache do you think it would like intensify i wouldn't have a headache that's true your head would just expand i guess Time to run. No, oh, thanks. Mm -hmm. Just keep on booking. Oh, fireflies. I could not believe my eyes. It's 10 billion fireflies. Do the Aristocats walk like this? Is that what I'm thinking of? They kind of, of do, don't they? He I made knows. a mistake. He knows. I made a mistake. They're not that hard if you just don't let them tackle you like that. I just want my... my They're inside of him, dude. Oh, are they? <laughs> His eyes are glowing with the power Fuck. of your souls. Remember, you can still backstab them, even if you're not stealthed. I didn't have confidence. I did remember that I could, but okay. I, I didn't want to. That's fine. I just wanted to make sure you remembered. Thank you. All right, well, all right. I'm not, it's okay. We don't have to get involved in all that. <laughs> Come on in, the water's fine. Howdy, partner. <laughs> We're just in the local swimming hole. There's like one way around here that leads to a shortcut, and I don't quite remember which way it is, but. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. Is it past the torches? Back across the pond. What are you gonna do about it, punk? I think it's back the other way. This way? Yeah, people were saying it was back across the pond and to the left. So I didn't have to fight the little piggy at all. Well, you would you would have had to because you need to get your stuff back. But that's what I mean. I didn't even have to fight him that first time, right? So I guess not. You could have just gone around him. So yeah, I, I came uh, from here. I think it's left. Well, the only way is straight. Like the like left, like lefter. This this yeah, way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is where I came from. That's where you came from. Yeah. Yeah. There's a little guy that I ran away from, and I went this way. So is there another path out of here? Other than straight. Is it this way? I think it's this way. Oh, crap. I oh, know, I know, I know. Honk. <sighs> this is the way. A 
new smell evader for you to enjoy. That's a very scary smell evader. Just open. OSHA would not approve. OSHA, more like, oh shit. That elevator's bad. Yeah. Did you're, you did you hear, right. did you hear my good joke? Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's just that you didn't like laugh or react in any way. I'm literally like searching my brain neurons to uh, try and guide you correctly. I'm digging deep inside my mental capacities. Because I just want you to complete the shortcut before you like die or something. Wow, you have a little faith. Well, <laughs> last time. <laughs> <laughs> well, last time. We're just having a good time, man. I think you just go straight through the door that was in front of you down there. But what about all these other ways? Go there later. Do this first. Haven't I been here? I've been here. But do you remember how to get here? No. But I've been here. This is where, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. It's where we <laughs> ended the stream last time. Well, it's not exactly where we ended the stream last time. So you're good on shortcut then. Can you like come, can you like come here? If something happens? Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's the first elevator. Well, I'm asking you. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you sarcastic voice yourself? Okay, so I think you're good now because you got this elevator. And the rest you've already interacted with. All right, I just wanted to make sure. That was all. Look at how your cloak is. <laughs> Got a lot of fabric. I will definitely be curious to see how you do with this next boss. I know we've said it a lot of times. <laughs> that maybe this was going to be the one that was going to give you a challenge. I was really worried that that old woman was going to be my stopping point. But this one's this one's pretty tough. Okay. This one's a, a rough one for a lot of people. Hello? Hello? Oh, ghost? This pig is so mad at you. You got poisoned by the pig. I did. Can he go through that corridor? No. It's too big. Sweet. Too big, too pig. Do you think this might be a boss arena? Wow. Wow. Here we go, gamers. Oh, is this the three guys? It's the three guys. Okay. I actually don't. I know there's one person I'm supposed to go after first to like make it easier, but I don't know who that is. Okay. 
I don't like you. Nice jump. Thanks. Nope, don't like this spot. No, fuck. Big rock. Alright. Cloud strife. Fuck. I don't like this angle. You're just annoying. Oh, you have a... Come here. No. <laughs> like you're walking your dogs. Oops. You come here. I'm sure that this is like really boring for people to watch and I apologize, but. No, it's tense. So annoying. No, Mamma Mia Pizzeria. Okay. No, that's not going to do shit. Okay. Right, right, right. What? You stab at the ground, and the ground stab at me? Okay, this sucks. That was a good first attempt. I wasn't expecting a phase two. Yeah, That was a, on me. There's a phase two. This fight doesn't seem too hard. But it does seem like the kind of fight that's going to make me really frustrated.
Well, I can tell you that the phase two begins when any one of them gets to half health. Right. That's what I figured. So you, I think you did do really well in like getting them all down relatively evenly. Mm hmm. But there's like, you know, numerous strats for the best way to take them down. Not that I'm going to tell you any of those. Yeah, I, I don't want to. I never want any tips. No. In any way. Um. Leave me alone. Oh, yeah, the shortcut's pretty easy to get to, huh? Mm-hmm. It's not that horrendous of a run back. No. If you got the elevators up. Did you send the other one back up? I did not, no. No. Oh. Sorry, I'll send this one back. Is this one moving? Oh. Okay. The chains stay still. Yes, the elevator moves. The elevator moves. Got it. Someone was asking for lore about what they called the Snaz Ghoul. <laughs> uh, well, they're called Shadows of Yarnum, which uh, seems to have an implication that uh, they were they were Yarnumites of the past in some kind of way. You know, trying to dole out lore in ways that would be like what you could know at this point in the game with the lore we found. How come there are three of them? Because they're bros. Don't look at me. The polycule of Yarnum, yeah. You ready? <gasps> it's just like not the kind of fights I like. I take no enjoyment in fighting you three polycule. We're back. Your damage is really good, though. At least. Nice one. I've not hit the spitter yet. Candleman? Yeah. Candlejack? Fuck. I don't know why I did that. I'm like testing things out right now. That's fine. Nope. Holy shit. Are you all holding a candle? Oh no, you also have a sword. How have I not noticed you have a sword? Uh, that's a really good question. I don't know how you I thought he only that. spit. <laughs> I thought he was only a spitter. They, literally, they were both doing Stretch Armstrong sword thrusts on you in the last... Yeah, I thought he got... I thought his arm just got pointy like Terminator. 
And he was just stabbing it into the ground. And it was no, up. he's got a sword the whole time. Interesting. Sword start to finish. All right. Which seems kind of overpowered. Yeah, because, like, what's his brother got? The other dude just has a sword. And the other guy just has fire. And the other guy, well, he also has, like, a mace that he doesn't use. Oh, really. yeah. He this, just holds the mace, like, for comfort. This might be the one that breaks my, uh, my boss, my boss streak. My easy time boss streak. Well, I think you've got a pretty good grasp on the fight. I do, but, again, it's, like, not a fight that goes well with my head so it's it might take me a few attempts because i'll get impatient in your head in, in your head. head snake man snake man you know like nito i just didn't like nito yeah but nito's an extreme example of that type of thing yeah because nito wants you to adopt an entirely different build to beat him right which you refuse to do. <laughs> Bloodborne doesn't really have... I mean, it's got builds, but not the same way. Right. Bloodborne mostly just asks you to win. And I love that. Dance like you want to win. Oh, my God. I'm sorry. I'm Dance sorry. like nobody's winning. Oh, I see why you would want to go the root way. Because the pig can't go there. But then there's boys. There's boys swimming. Boys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a friend to pigs. Do not hurt me. Somebody mentioned that, like, yeah, technically you can put on your best fire resistance gear. Mm -mm. Um, but Julia's not going to do that. No. And honestly, I support her in this. You should know better than to ask this of me. How you, do I look? Oh, you, oh <laughs> that neck. My neck is so cold. If you know me, you know that I'm a big uh, fan of just just win. Yeah. But that's also how I work. We don't we don't need to make excuses, you know. It's like, oh, I'll die to three fireballs instead of two fireballs. Just don't get hit by the fireballs. Just dodge and hit. Ain't that hard? Nope, don't like this. Okay, better. I was scared the spitter would get me. I gotta hit you sometime, boy. I went past you. I went past you. Are you proud of me? I healed to full. I'm very proud. All right, everyone come here. I have to stop trying to counter, because I... Or just learn how to do it better. What a chop. Yeah. Okay, you're down on health. The one I haven't gotten, I think, is Candle Bro. Correct. 
Handlebro likes to stand in the worst position. Yeah. Which is mid-range. Tried to squeak it. Tough one, tough one. Yeah, it's a pretty, it's a pretty patient fight. Kind of taking your moments when you get them. You know, I just, I have a hard time with patient fights for stream. Because I don't want people to just be watching me do a little dodgy and run around and... A whole dance of nothing happening. I mean, I'll just say, as someone who was watching Northern Lions Lies of Peace streams. <laughs> yeah, but would our audience watch <laughs> 50 VODs of him fighting a single well, it, boss? His audience didn't watch it either. <laughs> <laughs> but I did. I watched it. <laughs> I did, I did love that he complained about the numbers for that VOD or for those the VODs on YouTube and then you watch him actually play and it's like 20 videos of him fighting the same boss he and was, him being like, I just don't care. He We're was just gonna fighting fight. the, the puppet king for like, I don't know, like four to four hours worth of VODs with a build that was just like fundamentally set up wrong. Like he put all his points in one stat, had a weapon that was based on a different stat. It had like no range. He wouldn't, it was, he didn't like engage with any of the systems. He was basically doing like a challenge run. But I still had fun watching it. Are they all parryable or just the sword guy? Anyone who swings at you is parryable. So I don't think the fireball one is, because I don't think fireball guy swings at you. Well, the reason I kept watching it is because he's genuinely having a good time the whole time. He has like no impatience in his soul, in his spirit. Yeah. He'll just fight the same boss over and over and over again. And every time he dies, he'll just go, you got me, kid. <laughs> Olive's hiding her face. Yeah, he doesn't get tilted. Yeah, a thing I'm I'm trying to embrace. And after almost every one, he would go, he'd go, next time, we've almost got it. I try to channel him when I'm feeling tilted. I don't want to tilt. Dodge too late. Yeah. Frickin' that man up. being between you and the others. Bad spot to be in. Nope. Okay. I hear you. Okay. Spitter is the middle. Slider. Slider, health bar. Fuck. I thought you were further away from me. He's got that Sephiroth ass sword. Yeah. Masamune, or whatever it's called. That's what it's called. Why don't you hurt each other a little bit? They're bros. Why do I gotta do all the work? You know what? No, I want Spitty Jim. Come on. 
Come on, come on, no! Julia's not learned the lesson from Northern Lion. She's not learned the lesson. She's tilting. I just don't like this fight. Yeah, you don't like any fight that isn't exactly what you want. <laughs> You're doing a good job. That's what I always want to impress. I upon. thought I was doing a good job, and then I got stuck on a tombstone, and that's why I'm frustrated because I was doing a good job, and then I died because I got stuck on a tombstone. Yeah, and I'm saying. Watch my steppy. I'm saying that's part of the fight, though. I'll tell you what you it's not part this. of. You the got fun. this. Damn. I want every boss stage to be like Final Destination in freaking Super Smash. I am worried because you, you've you run out of refills of blood vials. All right, I'll just have to win. <laughs> which is, a, which is a, a problem. There was someone in chat who said like something like, you can't help if you get tilted. And that's what's fucked up, is that I found that I can help if I get tilted. And that makes it all the worse when I do get tilted. Because I've succeeded in not getting tilted when I was going to before. Sometimes I can really wrangle it, and then other times I fail to wrangle it. But that's part of life, isn't it? That's how we learn and evolve. Sometimes the DC to not get tilted is too high. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. I'm hot. Oh, it's coming off. I'm hot because I got mad. Sweater's coming off. Gotta... <sighs> Here we go. Better patters, thought you were further. swan that's rare to see Yeah. 
Oh, he did jump. Okay, now candle. Stay close, I think. No! Ooh, that was so good! Oh, man. That was so good. I'm mad. You were playing your ass off on that one. I'm mad. That was awesome. That was like legitimately one of the cleanest fights I've seen of them. It was like mega clean and then you just like died. <laughs> I just got hit with everything at once. Yeah. You were killing it though. That was great. <sighs> Thanks. I guess I'm going to go flood some flood farm some blood vials. Flood some blood. A little blood flood. Snake man on the bridge I think will usually drops. Yeah, the snake head guys, I feel Several. like, drop three sometimes. Ah, fuck you! Gonna dip down here for a second. Sorry, everyone. Oh. Man, that was so tense. I think you would have had it mm -hmm. if he didn't like pull something you hadn't seen before right at the end. Yeah, what was that? It was like a like a big ground snake mm -hmm. maneuver. I didn't even think I processed it. I was just looking at my health being like, oh, God. <laughs> just get to a safe spot. I'm mostly listening in this fight. It's a very listeny fight. Which works out for me okay. You're ironically good at listening. Yeah. Those dudes are so annoying. Hey, two vials. Yeah, one but you vial. Used one. I would say just try the boss again. Don't worry about farming too much. All right. I can actually do some off, off stream farming this time if I remember to do it. I've been meaning to do it, I just keep forgetting. <sighs> Man, I wish I won that one. That's no, okay. That's like the soul's experience. I was so close. You're always thinking about the one where you were so close, and then the next two you just get like annihilated. Yeah. Not looking forward to that. And thinking, like, if only I'd won that one, I could be done with this. Yeah. Isn't there a guy in here? Hey, what's up? Yep, I'm down here. 
Can I stun your snakes? <laughs> you didn't love it. No. It was enough to change up his moves. All right. Oh, nice. Made him stop for a second and go, the, the, hey. <laughs> hey. That was Did you just shoot nice. me? We're gentlemen here and we use swords. Oh, we were having a, a melee battle. What's up, my man? I'm not interested. Not today. Okay. How does the pig hear me over the pig's own feet? It doesn't hear you, it just turns around as part of its cycle. No, but like it caught me early, you know. Like there, I believe it spun around at the end of its cycle. Oh, well, yeah, if you run, it does hear you. Yeah, like how? Well, you know how like when you're even when you're walking, mm -hmm. if you hear like the sound of a, another footstep, even if it's quiet, your brain like tunes in on that shit. That's fair. It like triggers your I'm being followed response. Yeah. Pigs probably got that. This is the run. I'm not feeling it, but you know. You said that on Amelia too, and then you won. That's true. Okay. Recenter, recenter. Just dodge and hit. Just dodge and hit. That's all it is. That's all this game it's is. It's not hard. Dodging and hitting. Do you a little flurry? Nope. Same. Stop talking. Only focus. Okay. I don't want to waste my blood vial. Let's just die. No. My souls! I don't know why you did that. I don't know why you chose to do any of that. I, it was <laughs> that or waste of my blood vial. It's not a waste if you win the fight! <laughs> now with that start that start you could change it any time crystal clean at any point you could just start doing better <laughs> it doesn't have to be at the very no, beginning no I have to have a strong start that guy's like you're a mystery man is run through the I don't know I've always been like that every time that I've had to fight a boss like multiple times if it starts off bad I just like Reset because I feel like my head's not going to be in the right spot. I'm just going to start off frustrated, and I can't. You can't win Dark Souls frustrated or the Bloodborne series frustrated. Yeah. And I feel like I say this every time we play one of these games, but it truly doesn't matter that she lost the Blood Echoes. Oh yeah, it was 40, a lot of blood echoes. 40,000 seems like a lot, especially if you're like new to these games, but once you've played several of them, it like it just doesn't matter. You just get so many from beating bosses that release your worldly attachments. It's just not a big deal. Let nothing tether you to a failure. It is fun to say black goes though. When you let go of keeping your blood echoes failing truly feels just fine yeah sometimes i purposefully don't pick them back up if i'm in a boss fight because it's it's too distracting like once i lose them then i'll have nothing to lose yeah i can be free from my attachments well the only thing i'm upset about now is blood vials but yeah. oh yeah those those are pretty important at this juncture
Let go of my blecos. <laughs> hey, Shadows of Yarnum. Let go of my blecos. The ads are about to start. I'm sorry, everyone. It's alright. I'll still be fighting this boss unless I die. Well, okay. simultaneous move, huh? Spitter. Touched him that time. I did. Wow. He's he the swung. mace. He swung at you. So you're the last bar. He's the bottom. He is the bottom. Here are your little pitter patters. about you, my guy. down. You're the one that I'm most nervous about.
the fuck is that? I just want to say that was like five tries. <laughs> that was like five tries. Is that how many it was, chat? Just dodge and hit, everyone. Just dodge and hit. Five or six? I think it was five. I feel sweaty. I'm it's, sorry. It's freaking Joy. insane. Sorry. It's freaking insane. <laughs> I scared the cats. That was good though. Great job. Oh god, thanks. You played it so well. Hello. Thank you. Yeah, I was trying to remember whose move scared me the most and then go after them. Like go at it so that everyone's even for the for the final transformation. And then Yeah. It was a good strat. It worked out. And then tried to go for the sword boys cuz they had those uh under the sea moves where they pop in through the ground. And I can't anticipate those, so. Always bow to the doll. Welcome home, good hunter. What is it you desire? A level up, please. Very please. well. Let the echoes become your strength. Let me stand close. Now shut your eyes. Okay, so we're going for strength and skill and and any points in endurance you feel like you want. I do want some more. I want some more. Thank you. Hunters have told me about okay. I would you of course I do, isn't Of course. Farewell, good hunter. May you find your worth in the waking world. Go find your damn worth in the waking world. Girl, I strive to do that every day in my damn life. What do I got? I got communion. I don't need that one. Let's do... I really enjoyed using Blood Rapture when I played. Yeah, I think that would be good. Just because it's a free way to heal. Yeah. Oh. Mamma mia. Did I say what weapon I think Julia's going to love when she gets it? No. I did not say. Because I think there's an equal, equal chance that Julia will just use the Saw Cleaver for the entire game. Very possible because she already likes it and like is used to its move set. What you got? You got anything new in here? No. No. Okay. <sighs> Three blood vials left, huh? Yeah, we'll farm up next time. Yeah. All right, I feel like we don't have much time left in the stream, so I'm going to keep going. We got 20 minutes. 22 minutes. Uh, Forbidden Grave? Forbidden Grave. Oh. Forbidden Grave. Oh, why? Oh, why? I could buy some blood vials, but no, I well, you're, not. You're going to be back in the exploration segment now, so you'll probably start finding more. That's true. You, you build them up in the exploration and then spend them all in the boss fight. 
Sorry to the polycule that I just murdered. But, you know, you came at me. All I was doing was wandering through a graveyard. It was self-defense. Alright, well, I think I'm <laughs> done with Bloodborne for today. <laughs> You all know and love Snake Woods, but have you decided to check out Bug Woods? That sucked. Oh, we're together. That bug fucked you up more than I've <laughs> ever seen one of those enemies fuck anyone up. He like full comboed you. Yeah, yeah. You got hit with every move he had available in his arsenal in a row. Yeah. Ugh. And then he frenzied you to death. Yeah, sorry everyone. You literally beat one of the harder bosses and then go get killed by the, the first bug you see. I thought it was gonna be like a a crow where I can just keep hitting and he dies. But I can't. Oh, he's glowing now. Yeah, he's got your freaking juice. She did it. The real boss defeated. Take that, you ass. You ass. You. Hmm. Alright, I won't look. Oh, you're two different statues. Okay. That's cool. Welcome to Bergenworth. Ber Welcome to Bergenworth, baby. But I was I've heard so much about Bergenworth. I never thought I'd see the day. You ready to go to college? Let's go to school! We're going to college, baby freshman year! Let's, Let's go! Party. Oh my god, is there going to be a boy storm? I hope there's babes here. I hope there's a... That's not a babe. I think he's trying to get me to sign up for his club. That's not a babe, that's a bug. They Sign got my petition. Babes and bugs Whoa. and the moon. The moon. You know what they say at Bergenworth. We got the moon. They do say that, yeah. <laughs> Remember when they like revived that and I was like, ah, we've officially hit the era of commercials that are aimed for millennials. Yep, I do remember that. Look at him walk. I'm sorry that I just like came over and uh oh, I tonight is warning. Back. Yep, I don't take it back. I don't take it back. I don't take it back. Don't frenzy me. Don't frenzy me. Don't, 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 don't. I thought that might be enough. They frenzied you. I'm trying like so hard to not get got by these stupid bugs for chat. But they're so freaking fast, and I'm not used to enemies being fast in this game. Julia's like, oh no, a challenge I have to face <laughs> in that... Bloodborne? I've <laughs> never faced one before. I'm not even saying it's a challenge. I'm just not used to it. Oh no, a hardship? <laughs> I've never experienced one in Bloodborne. Oh no. <laughs> Guys, what I'm saying is that it's really hard being good at the game. <laughs> okay, I'm not used to not being good. I'm excited for you to see the other bugs they got. I don't... I don't know how I feel about that statement. A Schlorper! Oh god, you. A Zoidberg. <laughs> Now that's the noise from college that I'm used to. Hey, right? so true. That's Frat the noise boys I was making in college. each other. From, I was going to say something vile. Oh, don't. I was going to say from all those free cafeteria puddings. That's better. I like that better. When I was too lazy to get myself a spoon. 
don't do it. Don't, 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 don't. Oh, no. Oh, no. You had like a health left. Then you dropped your guard, didn't you? I did. Arcane Lake! I'm out of blood vials. Just don't get hit. Alright. Just make, you know. Hey, where's orientation? I was told... Is that my RA? <laughs> <laughs> I always imagined my RA would be pretty big, so... Can you go in the side door of... I put... Bergenworth? The moon. Well, I just was asking. I don't remember. I was gonna say something about how I feel like I'm about to no, fight Renala. You can't. That does look like Renala's moon. I guess it's the same moon. Is this Renala's moon? Okay. okay. Doesn't technically the existence of the moon and the sun imply that all of these games take place on Earth? Stop, you little freak! Weirdo. Damn. They do run so fast. I do really like the little sounds of their feet running. Acting like other planets don't have moons and suns. That's our freaking moon. That's our moon and no one else's. Oh my God. Look at that. If you look at that moon, it's our moon. <laughs> Mamma mia. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just let me you could take a shortcut. Just let me open that. I'm gonna go into the school. <laughs> you can never be too careful. A cake! For me! Orientation cake. Oh, wow. It's eyeball themed. That's gonna be like my eyes on all these books, am I right? Getting all that knowledge. So true. Is that a treasure <sighs> chest behind you? What? There aren't mimics in this game. I don't believe you. I don't trust anyone. I'm not. You fearing. got the pearl slug. Is <laughs> <laughs> that my, is that my like a uh, uh, orientation? Like a uh, everyone, so everyone knows I'm a freshman. I yeah. have to wear my. my you got to carry the pearl slug. That's a material used in a holy chalice ritual. Oh, look at it. It's so cute. Of all the strange life forms that reside in the nooks and crannies of the old labyrinth, the slugs are clear signs of the left behind great ones. Clear signs? I mean, you saw that dude who slurped your gorp. His whole head like became a slug to do it. I don't know if I'd see that guy and be like, that's beautiful. That proves God exists. No, not God. Oh, okay. The great ones. Wayne Gretzky. Not Wayne Gretzky. Who, who the hell? Are you a summon? Ah! <laughs> who the fuck is you? What the hell? Wh whipping your corpse. I do like your... That's your RA. Damn. <laughs> I do like his weapon. I just walked onto this floor and he started blasting. Because I made too much noise in the library? Damn. I love when their little back paws come together like this. It looks so cute. Yeah. Where am I? Okay, I know where I am. You're at college, baby! Freshman year! Woo! Do you want to guess how much partying I did in my freshman year of college? Zero. Correct, Amundo! I bet you just worked. <laughs> you were so happy to get your blood echoes. Can you be nice to me? I don't have any I don't I don't have any healing. To be fair, I didn't do any partying my freshman year either. 
I did not begin partying until my sophomore year. Oh, uh, do you want to guess how much partying I did my sophomore year? Zero. Yeah. Guys, if you thought maybe Julia was fun at any point in her life, the answer would be no. Listen, it's not your fault. It's true. And I'd like to think you've had plenty of fun. Oh, in, I've had fun. In I your, just in your thirties. I, I just don't think that people would watch out. Um, I literally said, watch out. I was hitting the dodge, <laughs> but I went too slow. I was just joking. It's like a move that shoots everywhere. <laughs> yeah. Watch out. Somebody said partying does not equal fun. It depends on what you define as partying. True. I feel like a lot of people think of partying as one thing. But the partying that I did sophomore year was like with my friends that I liked. We would have a party that was like, you know, 10 of us that were all close friends. Well, I, I think it wasn't like going out and getting blackout and I, I think a thing that I had trouble coming to terms with for a while was like, the, why are you like musking on me, dude? Um, was like, I don't like drinking and partying and having like a, a rowdy time. You know what I mean? Um, but all my friends did and all of my friends had the ability to do that and I did not. So I like couldn't, I thought I was safe under the stairs. <laughs> it's got AOE. It's got owie. Yeah. And it does owie to you. Um. Oh, she's covering her little eyes. I think like I had to accept that my friends like the partying part. Like your friends all have different friends because they all need different things from different people and they all enjoy doing different things with different people. And I was the person that they did not go to parties with. Instead, I was the person that they called when they were very drunk to tell me about the party. <laughs> and they really enjoyed that. And so that didn't mean that I was like a buzzkill or not fun. It was just like, I was a different fun. Yeah, you got different friends for different things. And you got to know, like, they, they knew what you were going to enjoy, what you weren't going to enjoy. I think I was always just, like, very self-conscious of the fact that I, like, couldn't go to parties. The real party is doing something you enjoy with people you care about. Yeah. And who don't make you feel bad for not being able to party. Yeah. Which were my friends. Yeah. Realize you had a third. What? What are you, what are you spraying me with? <laughs> what are you spraying me with? Why are you spitting? Pesticides. The fuck? You're no longer. You're you're fucking. You're fucking GMO. I was close to beating them, and you, I haven't had any blood vials. You're GMO now, baby. You don't go in the organic section anymore. Damn. Technically, bananas can't do that either. Banana. Just like the minions always say. <laughs> if it's pesticides, why so many bugs? Uh, did you notice where there's not any bugs? Inside the house. Because of the pesticides. Someone, I only saw it for a quick second, but um, someone reminded me of the story. So I think I've told this on stream before, but my best friend and I are very different people. Stop spitting on me, dog. 
Uh, she is a partier, wild style lady. Um, she is rowdy, she's loud. She loves to get entirely too drunk. Uh, she has a good time. Uh, for her bachelorette party, she invited me because I was in her bridal party. And she sent me an invite and I had like a crisis about it for like two weeks. So I was like, I can't like go to this party. Can you like let me go? Can you let me go? Can you let me go by? She's trying to roll past him. Anyway. Um, so anyway, so I was talking to like my other close friend and like we were bouncing back and forth about it and she was like, I think you should just tell her that like you can't go. I was like, okay. So I called my best friend and I was like, I don't think I should go to your bachelor party. I'm really sorry. Like if you really want me to go, I'll go. And she goes, oh, I wasn't expecting you to go. I just didn't want you to feel left out by not inviting you. And I was like, that's very sweet. But I wish I had just told you up front. Ah! Sorry. I got scared by the bug. You sure did. You got, you got a, you're, this is exactly what happened the first time you fought one of these bugs. You don't have the stam to, to full combo them. I know, them. and I hate it. I need a little bit more stam. I keep thinking because I upgraded my stam. You're addicted to stam. That's the problem. You're a stamaholic. Why do I do that? Every time. Ah! Anyway, point being. <laughs> Women in <and> Stam. <laughs> point being is that my friend knew me better than I thought she did. And uh, I, I sincerely appreciated how she uh, handled that. It was very kind of her. It is a very nice story. Yeah. I just, especially at that time, I'm better now, but like even when Jacob and I first started dating, I was still in a place where I could not be near people who drank a lot. She was just fucking whipping your ass. She's a she? I, I always thought of them as a she. I don't know. Maybe it's a he. Stop fucking. Excuse me, can you tell me your gender? Can you stop Are shooting lasers? Are you a lasers? woman in Stam? Are you a woman in Stam? She's a she. She's a she. Her name is Yuri? On ice? Or on lesbians? Yuri the Last Scholar. She sprayed your ass. Yeah, and I died because of it. I hate that. I mean, you are trying to take her out with no healing. So you, I, I got you have close. To, yeah, you did get really close. You can definitely do it. I just have to be better. All right, can you? That's what I'm talking about. Jerk. Oh, high five. What's your feet situation? <laughs> don't <Bugs>? ask, don't <laughs> ask that. <laughs> Bug. I could do this no healing i've been playing dragon's dogma too oh wait i do have a healing having a great time and that reminded me there's a cute thing in that game where after like every fight you do if you walk near one of your pawns they'll like hold out their hand and you just like slap hands with them <laughs> and they're like an excellent fight master and sometimes you do like a fist bump instead
<laughs> the spray is really funny. Cut it let's out, go! Punk. Let's go! Three blue elixirs, three blue elixirs. Now who will keep the library bug free? Three blue elixirs. You want to summon Damien of Mensis? Who's Damien? He's he's of Mensis. <laughs> oh. Oh yeah, read the book. When the red moon hangs low. The line between man and beast is blurred. And when the great ones descend, a womb will be blessed with child. Okay. <laughs> Damien of Memphis. <laughs> <laughs> hey, buddy, just got in from Memphis. All right, so I think the enemy slash boss I've had the hardest time with is that ledge. That one ledge. Yeah. Well, funny enough, oh, there's a, there's a treasure. The student's uniform. Oh my god. Oh, oh, I'm so I'm so excited. I think we've actually got I mean, obviously the stream is uh, you know, ending. But you can scope the next boss. Oh yeah? Cuz I'm pretty sure he's like right out the door. Oh, what's this? The spider hides all manner of rituals, certain to reveal nothing, but true enlightenment need not be shared. That's what I always say. I just tell people that I'm enlightened. And, and, they're, they're, like, and they're like, tell me the secret. How so? And I'm like, true enlightenment need not be shared. So. Is it up or through here? Through there. Oh, never mind. Wow. Looks like one of those cool unfoldable sundials. Any freaks up here? I hear a freak. The Lunarium Key. The what? The Lunarium Key. Lunarian? The Lunarium Key. Hmm. What is it? The Lunarium Key. <laughs> <laughs> Your uh, ability to say that multiple times the same way is impressive. Say what? Oh my god. Come down here. Come down. Come on. Come on. Tinnitus, 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 tinnitus. You're gonna die. There's nothing you could have done. Unless I killed that stupid bug. You just didn't have enough HP to survive the frenzy. Because I have no vials. All right, well, that's probably the end of it then. Yeah. And I'll farm. What All a, farm. What a pathetic ending. I'm going to the farm. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. Before next time. You're going to have so many vials. I died to a stupid bug. I died to a bug. I'm sorry. But hey, you beat the shadows of Yarnum. The shadows of Yarnum. It sounds like a band. Yeah. Maybe they I are a band. We're the shadows of Yarnum. So again, it's a great job. You're really motoring through this game. What if I play for her, the box? Does it do anything? No, it's not related to her in any way. Oh. <laughs> What'd you think about that? You like that? You like that? Okay. All right, well.
That's it. You want to flip to the cami? Yeah. Flip it to the cami. Flip it to the cami. I got to read the subs, but before we do that, we will say that we're streaming on Droppy tomorrow night. Ah! And we're going to be talking about Mocha. Yep. Our experience at Mocha and all the nice people we met. Mm hmm. And it's going to be a fun time. Yeah. And then we'll be back on Wednesday, probably with Ghost Trick, I imagine. Ghost Trick. Ghost Trick. And then Friday is Draw Class with Karina, mm -hmm. who's doing a critique stream. Yep. Critique of your art. If you are a person at that tier and have posted your art in the Draw Class Discord chat, then, yes. then they'll look at it. Then they'll look at it. On I, the stream. I don't know who's second seating that, but I guess that's something we'll talk about tomorrow. Probably Nathan. Probably Nathan. It's usually Nathan. Yeah. But who can say where the road goes? Yeah. Uh, let me let me read the subs. Okay. Um, Olive's getting down. Olive's getting down. She's getting down. I'll see y'all in a minute when Jacob's done. That's like the first part to flossing. <laughs> I'm learning <Step> one. <laughs> I'm learning to floss one part at a time. Very slowly. Okay, here we go. Oh, should I point the camera at Joy? Yeah. I feel like she's gonna get up. And I will have wasted my time. Let's see. Don't you do it, Joy. You stay right there while I'm reading subs. You stay, you keep your ass right there. All right, we got subs from Mike Oisoski, Cold Kinetic Heat, Sovi Voss, Mint Berry Jam, Froyo Baggins, Artie Art Fart, Dak Kotex, Celestial Kitten Zero, Colin Melia gave out five gifted subs. Thank you so much. Valerium. Anonymous Gifter, Rai Gumi, Yurtgert, Fear How It Heals, Arcade Fire, Mandy Guggs, Bun Arkist, Mystery Mike, Malicious Mischief, Little Birdie, Shazamethist, Sir HC, Mix Morganic, Logan Felkson, Cland, Palm, Sparkling Dumbass, and Curious Panda, Dark Winged Angel, Lesbian Rat Consort, hell yeah, let's go. Spencer's Avalanche, Sayerwa, Smaumo, Chorkin in the Sporcial Sauce, AO, Panic, Garlic Bride, Indie Kill Bride, Fred McTaker, Muscular Beaver, Teacops 3, Adam's Too Much, Yurtgert, Mashual X, or Masu Alex, I never know. I press 1, 6 Traffic Cones, Ken's Pets Dogs, Genesis Infinite, Mora 40, Todd Football, Finds Any Day, Punk Chard, Katie Cat Magic, Seaweed Bee, Emily Nya, Just Like Bart, Cyclocentric, McNick Knock, Moo Gerald, I Require Coffee, Tong, Tonka Tough, Badonka Donk, Miss Raisin King, Everybody Needs Therapy, Boudica the Brave, Mayday, Govanek, Rainy Kens, Roly Poly Broly, Bex This Mess, Upsetty Spaghetti 26, LPS 33, Minnow IJ, Partitioning, Starrags Gale, Elf and Sabu, Zappy Child, thank you Zappy, Codename Blueprint, The Babe with the Power, Desert Librarian, Composite Ghost, Dr. Vinca PhD, Count Creature, Sexalia De Rolo, Cool Sebastian, Feed Me Burritos, Cujo Ramsey, Holly Blue 2, Voller, Lesbian Rat Consort, Gifted 5 Subs, thank you so much. Equation 24, Martin Bobom, Benzo Baggins, Detective Hoops, Glamphomet, Vixen Art, Mitomondria, Bardbarian Boy, Mini Stroni, Honka Hondas, A Very Dedicated Duck, Yotol, Ranny Art, Azarafel, Nivlak 3D, Summer Edge, Professor Rad, Gifted 5 Subs. Thank you as always, Professor Rad. ZZ Nation, Ember Wildflower, Knife Snail, Maximum Cowboy, Chalkline, Orange Witch, Chimamel, Izzy Busy, Doodlezack62, Avant Garde Bard, Avatar Cliffy, 
Piggy Poo, T Gremlin, Straw Hat J, Sly as a Wolf, Planet, Run by Tigers, Jax Carrion, Little Rat Goblin, Velveeta's Mom, Mire Ray, Feral Pond Siren, Small Time Cat Crime, Martle B, Yurt Gert, Bex Machina, Bot Valpel, White Morpheus, Sync, Mechatrans, Riggs, Bad Teeth, Gabby Gadget, Nvidia Siren, Mad Dr. Dan, M, Deets Mom, His Best Mom, Marrow Biba, Garrulous Monolith, Doodles, Noodles, Doodles, Cassowary, Kick, Yurt Gert gifted two sets of 10 subs. Thank you so much, Yurt Gert. Holy shit. Sorry I didn't notice that earlier. Artemis, Wolfman Dan, Transgender Goblin, Kiwi Kuro, Yurt Gert again, Walter Mitty, Rip Gina, Sodi Pap, Oh Wonderful, Little Miss Green Bean. Okay, we're going back to the top. Jackson Jupiter, The Elderberry, Mix Family Lamp, sorry you raided right at the end of stream. And uh, Cold Kinetic Heat, I think that's it. Thank you all so much for watching and for hanging out with us. I give Joy a pet. Oh, Julia slid in. <laughs> Try to put the camera back in a reasonable position. Probably like there-ish. Thanks, everyone. We'll see you tomorrow night on Droppy. Yeah! Bye! Bye!